Christmas Eve services have long been a tradition for many denominations in the Christian faith, and as with everything else, they look a little different this year. Parishioners gathered outside tonight, and as ABC 10 News reporter Cassie Carlisle tells us, they're thankful just to be together. Here at All Souls Episcopal Church, this was the first time they had outdoor services in the last two weeks because of the rise in coronavirus cases. And for everyone who showed up, tonight was very special. Celebrating the reason for the season. I think that we're incredibly lucky that we can still meet, that we have the space outside that we can meet, and we have the, the parish that wants to meet. Leaning on their faith to get through hard times. Churches adapting during the pandemic, worshiping online or outside. In Chula Vista, South Bay Pentecostal Church is still fighting for services to be allowed indoors in the court system. Even though the Supreme Court ruled last month, places of worship in New York are allowed to do just that, citing their First Amendment rights. And just days ago, Los Angeles followed suit, changing their health code due to a recommendation from that Supreme Court ruling. Christmas Eve is Christmas Eve, and, and so we just try to do our best. Back at All Souls in Point Loma, they're just thankful to be together. Life is everywhere, and God is everywhere if you believe in God. While services were more intimate, Father Peter said this is one for the history books. The children's service, the children's pageant, is always the biggest service of the year, practically, just packed last year. But, um, yeah, it, it's, you know, I know the little kids will never forget this, you know, just being outside and seeing their friends for the first time in nine months. And, um, yeah, it was very sweet. Everyone here at the church hopes that next year is better, brighter, and that they get to celebrate indoors. Reporting in Point Loma, Cassie Carlisle, ABC 10 News.